Sometimes you've created an edit in which you've placed the timeline clip event exactly where you want it, but the video it holds isn't timed quite perfectly. In other words, the event sits in the right place, but the video it holds does not. In cases like these, you could move the event so that the video sits in the right spot, and then trim away the portion of the event that you don't want on one end, and add a portion of the event back onto the other end. This is a cumbersome way to edit, and can lead to editing mistakes. For a faster and safer solution, slip the event instead. When you slip an event, or more accurately, slip the contents of the event, you leave the event right where it is, but you slip the video within the event to a new position. To see how this works, add a clip to your timeline, and trim off some of the beginning and end of the timeline clip event. Now hold the Alt key and point to the event. Notice that the mouse icon changes to the slip icon. When you have that icon, click and drag your mouse within the event. As you do, you slip the media within the event. The video preview window switches to a split view that shows the beginning frame of the event on the left and the ending frame on the right. Once you've slipped the media to where you want it, release the mouse button and the Alt key. This slipping technique works in all versions of Vegas Pro and Vegas Movie Studio.